Hey you guys, so I saw something on Amazon and figured for the price, I will go ahead and give a shot and see what it was about. So today, we're going to open this up and show you what I decided to get. And as you can probably see already, so they had this LED portable HD projector, regular $199 with $50 off, with an additional $50 off. And then I had an additional $30 in Amazon coupons. So I figured I'd give it a shot and see what this is all about. But this is what we have here. Hold on, let me get some of this stuff out of the way. A little craft mat. Yes, the missus does craft. But as you can see, LED portable projector. LED portable projector. Huh, made in China. Okay. Isn't everything? So... This is the white version. Sorry, you guys trying to do all this one-handed, but let's lay this down and see. Ah. So, All right, let me pause this and get this out of the box and I'll be right back with you guys. All right, so LED portable projector made by Jafar. Sounds like a company I've never heard of. We got a pocket here. Seems to be empty. Bring this back around. Open it up and see what we have. Now this is supposed to come with the screen and everything. 120 inch screen, I do believe, which, boom, oh, there it is. Well, as you can see, just checked, 120 inch, 16 by nine. A simple projection screen. And what do we have here? We have a product manual. Oh, another $20 Amazon card. Uh, some sort of microfiber wipe. Got to be for the lens. Put that to the side. Then we have. Video cable, audio video cable. I don't know who's gonna use that. Then looks like just audio. Mini to red and white. HDMI cable. Remote. Kind of resembles a fire stick remote. And Power cord. Now, let me pause this and get the projector out. Okay, so from the front, lens, looks like an IR sensor, lens cap. We got focus, keystone. Then on top, we've got power button. I'm gonna guess menu. Uh, I don't know what that is without looking at the book. Left, right, up, down, okay, and the back button. Um, 
sides. This vent air speakers. Vent air and speakers. Now, and then this also. Oh, I'm about to tear it up already. Let me pause it for a minute. All right, and from the back, we've got VGA, another infrared sensor, USB 1 and 2, HDMI port 1 and 2, sound, video, and the SD card slot. Now, it says this also has Bluetooth, but I don't see any symbols on it that say it's Bluetooth capable, so we'll have to check that out once we hook it up. Um, I'm going to stop the video here. i give you guys another look once I have it all hooked up and connected. Okay, hey you guys. So I'm back now. I got the um, projector mounted and um, the screen that came with it. I just threw it up on the wall just so I can see what this is like. I do have the light on. Um, also, it is still daylight out. Open the blinds so we can get a good view of what this thing looks like. So, all right, we're gonna power it up here. As you see lights turn blue. just kicked on I don't know if you heard the fans it's not not very loud but um hmm. whoa this isn't bad at all yeah this isn't bad at all that's with the light on blinds open So, yeah, this is, turn it down some now. I don't even know what this is, but as you can see, it's comes through pretty good. So, let's see what it looks like in the dark. Got some blinds, some blackout curtains. Come on. All right, give me a second here. Hey Google, turn off Deja Light. This is a native 1080p projector. And I did double check, it does have the built-in Bluetooth. But yes, I'm very impressed with this. With this projector for 168 bucks from Amazon, and as you can see, that's the side there. On the side there, it's not very loud either. The fan on it's not very loud at all. This is something that I'm thoroughly impressed with. I know before I said, I'll take you guys through the menu here. So, yeah, picture mode, color temperature, you can set your aspect ratio, reduce the display size to, you know, fit the screen and whatnot. It has sound mode, and that's why I said, after going through the settings, I did see that it had Bluetooth, so you can't Bluetooth your phone to it. That's just a timer, on-off timer. And then, on-screen display, language, duration, software update. But, that's the menu that it offers. Like I said, this is the menu. Two HDMI, VG, VGA, AV, it has two USB ports, and it does have an SD card slot on it. So, you hit the source, and see it says 1080p at 60 hertz. 
And like I said, this this is not bad at all. I'm gonna drop a link in the description for for this. I'm thoroughly impre impressed with this for 160 some odd dollars that I paid for it, straight off Amazon. And this this is you can see the color on this, and you can see the clarity in the picture on this. So give it a, give it a check out, you guys. I mean, in my opinion, it's totally worth it. So thanks for checking out the video and I'll see you next time.